Hey everyone, Camber here back with you and today we're talking about how to set up your Canon DSLR picture profile settings in order to help your videos look even better. First off, things look different because I just moved and haven't set up my new studio yet, but if you're new here, this is all you know. And by the way, this channel is all about teaching you how to use your camera to make good videos, so if that's you, consider subscribing. I made another video about camera picture profiles and why they're so useful based on video data compression and other various video effects. So check that out if you want to have a better in-depth knowledge of why shooting in this flat desaturated profile is crucial to maintaining your image quality when you get to editing. But this video is just going to cover the color settings I use when I shoot with a Canon camera in order to give me the most flexibility when it comes to color correction and color grading. Now the current Canon DSLRs don't come with any log picture profiles installed like the Sony cameras do. That you can download and install Canon's version of various picture profiles into your Canon camera. However, these are aftermarket installations and I've never actually used one. Instead, I simply just changed to a flatter picture style in the menus that remove some of that saturation and sharpness that the default picture style bakes into your footage. So first, make sure you go into video mode and then enter your menu. Scroll through your menus until you get to picture style, and here you'll see multiple program picture styles to choose from, but we're gonna scroll down to the user defined section and make our own. Open the display on the user defined, and then we'll start changing the settings. First is sharpness, so we're gonna take that all the way down to zero. Next is contrast, and we're going to turn that one down to negative two. Then we're gonna take the saturation down to negative two as well, and finally, we're going to leave the color tone at zero because Canon's colors are pretty good. So this is a good starting point, and once you get used to how your camera renders your shots, you can always go back in and adjust those settings to better suit your shooting style. Just create a profile in your camera and try it. However, one important thing to note in addition to setting this flat color profile is that you want to make sure you set your white balance properly for the type of light you're using. If you leave your white balance on auto, your colors will shift throughout your shots, which you definitely want to avoid. And if you don't know what white balance is, just check out this video I made here because it is a very important setting on your camera. And it can be a little difficult to see how the white balance is set since your image on the viewfinder is so flat. So what I do to check the white balance is to switch to the standard picture style, set the white balance, and then switch back to the flat style. And that way you'll know the white balance is as close to correct as possible. And that's it, just a few quick adjustments and you'll be able to have much more flexibility when it comes to applying video effects to your footage in editing. So if this video is helpful, go ahead and hit that thumbs up and let me know down below if you do have any more questions about these color settings on your camera. And if you haven't seen the other picture profile video I made, be sure to check that out. I'll link it down in the description because it does explain a lot more. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't and remember that the only way to get better at something is to practice. So get out there and film something. See you soon.